Hello, welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to be showing you how to pack test a class one appliance and uh, on this particular thing is a mixing desk, an audio mixing desk, quite common with DJs, uh, bands, etc, etc. Um, so we're going to show you how to do that. So first of all, you need to do a full visual inspection of the appliance. Check there's no damage to the casing either on the top or on the bottom underneath. Check there's no damage to the socket either. And then what we need to do once we've done our full vision inspection is we need to connect our IEC test cable from the pack tester to the mixing desk. And then what we're going to do is we're going to connect our test probe to a piece of metal um, on the appliance somewhere. So we test like that. Okay. And then what we're going to do is we're going to start the test sequence. So the test sequence will be starting off here. And that shows a reading of 0 0.04, which is a pass. Okay, now because we're doing it manually on the pack test machine here, um, so when you're running through a predefined sequence of tests, it would also need to carry out the insulation resistance test, um, which is there because I'm doing it manually in this particular point. So we'll keep the test probe still connected. It's not essential on a class one test, um, but seeing as it's um, still attached anyway, there's, there's no harm in uh, leaving it attached. And then we'll run the test again. And that gives us our reading greater than 19.99, which is a pass. Um, if you refer to the Code of Practice 5th edition, um, that's a very good um, benchmark for pack testing. And that will give you your tolerances, uh, both for earth continuity tests and for insulation tests. So it will give you acceptable readings, um, what are passes and failures uh, related to the equipment that you are testing. Uh, if there's anything else you would like to see, any video you particularly want me to run over, then please uh, comment on this video and please subscribe to my channel. Thank you.